Hello everyone, welcome to Northy Plays Games, and today I'm playing Beach Life. Now this is going to be sort of a, a longish playthrough where I'm going to do the campaign missions, uh, progressing from level 1, 2, 3, and unlocking all the other levels, and then maybe go through a sandbox as well. So, uh, this game is sort of, you, need, you have a resort, and you, for the campaign you set certain challenges to complete, which varies from like building sort of um eating and drinking place to sort of cleaning up the island and hiring staff and it is a really really good game it's a really old game i think it's very limited that you can actually buy it now it was published in 2004 um and it's yeah it's a reasonably good game so i hope you enjoy my playthrough of it so let's go on to level 1 which is in at the deep end so it's a training level um, so let's go. Let's do it. Let's do it. Do it like a boss. So the objective today is to place any building on, on the island that doesn't... Oh. Okay, so I need to create 12 buildings uh, by day 3. So we've got a limited time to get these done. So we're going to go into the eating and drinking and make a beach bar on the beach. Um, so we're going to have that there. And then we're going to go and get a soft drink stall. Now some of the uh, buildings and things, some of them are open 24 hours. But some of them will close. You can also have the ability to open and close them yourself when they're built. Um, so yeah, this is an island. Um, some of the scenery, as you can see, is already made. The hotel will always be on your island. You can't build a hotel. But you basically, you know, do the gardens, you know, build everything like this. So, so when you want to unlock new items, you usually have to create something before that. Um, so, yeah, it's a great game. I recommend you trying to get it if you enjoy it. It's a bit like Roller Coaster Tycoon 2, but it doesn't have roller coasters. Uh, or Roller Coaster Tycoon 3, sorry. So I've also got a higher staff, uh, so cleaners obviously clean, um, and all that sort of good stuff. We've also got the builder's yard, we've got a lot of stuff. Um, we can also speed up if we're getting bored and we want to get stuff built quickly. Love that, it's great. <laughs> um, so, we're going to get some stuff, so I need to build a toilet. Um, we need to get... What else could we do? We can't do anything at the moment. But yeah, we need to make sure that we always have enough power supply, which is the powers here. We also have a star rate in the money. It tells you when the next uh, shipment of uh, guests come in. We've got the amount of people that are actually on the island and day one. So I have, also have these retarded messages at the bottom. But yeah, um, so we're getting this stuff done. We've got the ice cream place, we've got soft drinks. we got half a sh um, beach bar now we can build cafe which cafes are only open in the daytime so let's get on to here so we can actually I, don't, I know I'm not don't have to do this but it just looks a bit nicer if I do um, you know add a bit of gardens in it is nice so if any of you got any recommendations for my sandbox game playing through this uh, please put them in the comments and I will build uh, anything I'll we'll call it uh, Northies Island and we'll make a resort and ooh hello this dude seems to be peeing in a fountain that's lovely so unhappy why are you unhappy uh, cleanliness beauty safety nothing bad has happened to me okay mate um, right um, <laughs> right. Okay, so I'll speed this up a bit. Speed up! So we've got how many buildings we've got now? We've got four, five, six. It's only day one, so we can also build. Now we can build a beach bar which will offer some food. Uh, we can also build some beach showers, so I'm going to put those next to. In not an empty bit of the beach, so I'm going to have two sets of those because um, I can and I'm badass 
Okay, so we've only got five grand left. I could build a beach higher equipment. So this is going to be like the sort of the sporty area of the beach. Um. Do -do -do -do. So what can we do? So we could put the price up to sort of increase, but I don't know. Now I'm thinking through the daytime I play it, and then through the night I will speed it up. So because the night time is progressively boring. Um, right, we need to add some staff. Unless we have a nightclub, but that's not until further in the game. Come on, Mr. Builder. He's building that cafe on his own. <laughs> now, the builders stop working at night unless you change their shifts, but it's better if they all work in the day because he gets stuff done uh, increasingly faster. So, let's just watch our money and try and get more. If this commentary is boring, I apologise. I really do. I will try and find something to talk about next episode. So, yeah, this is... Yeah. <laughs> Oh my god, a guest has drowned. Oh my god. I have got a lifeguard, haven't I? Um, yeah, so I might put a link into Amazon to get this game. But, I don't know. It depends if you guys think it's a good game. It's a very old game, like I've said already about 40 fucking times. So yeah, sorry about this if the commentary is boring. I'm sorry. But I think the sandbox will be more fun, but you know, try and get... I've never actually completed the campaign on this game. Uh, which is quite surprising to be honest. I've had this game for about five years and I've never done the campaign. Uh, because uh, I really couldn't be asked, but I think it's better to play through it. So let's do that. Right, so we've got seven grand now, so we can actually buy the... Uh, I thought that's a pedo then. <laughs> that would have been funny. Right, how do I turn this now? Oh, it's... Right, there we go. Right, so if I just put that there. So let's see, we've got one, two, three more items to be built. So that'll take us up to eleven. Twelve, okay, so we should be done. Right, so if I just go back to slow mode. Okay, so here's all our happy guests arriving and all the pissed off ones going. Right, so we should be able to complete the campaign mission. Oh my god. Right, I didn't build any bins. That isn't good. Ooh, some nice lights there. Um, hmm, should I put just a bit of flames here? Uh, <laughs> now, if I remember, the next campaign mission is is more fun than this one. I'm not going to spoil anything. You'll be able to find that out on next episode. If this is more than 15 minutes, YouTube's going to rape me in the ass and say, No! You can't do that! And I'll be like, Yes, I can. Right, so we've got nine buildings now. Is that built? That's built. Have I done the maths wrong? <laughs> oh, please say I didn't do the maths wrong. I did as well. God damn it. Um, so we need to get that done. Let's go to speed up mode. <laughs> Let's speed it up. Speed it up, speed it up, speed it up. Ten buildings built now. Yay! Yay! Right, eleven. So I need one more now. Is that the cafe or has that already been done? Oh, so I need one more. Hmm. I could have this, I suppose. I could. Can I fit this here? Oh, I can. Oh, boom! Boom. Let's do this, right, last building, get this mission done. Look at all the builders, swarm on it, swarm, slow. Yes, boom, well done, you did it, in time for the rush. So, uh, check out the training level to learn more about the, if you prefer, you can carry on playing this level as long as you like. Uh, okay, so I'm going to exit to the menu, uh, so we, we'll be on level 2 next one. And we'll see, I will see you on the next episode. Thanks for watching.